Um, we had a superb discovery weekend in San Martino de Porto. We'll do that twice a year now. We'll have a, a November and a springtime fixture. And next up, Coimbra. We look forward to being in Coimbra. So it'll be lovely to talk to you because I know it's beloved to you, isn't it? It's your it's your biggest... My city. I was born in Coimbra, yeah. Isn't that amazing? So uh, we can maybe do a few highlights of Coimbra and uh, talk about seeing you there on the 9th and 10th of December. And also it occurred to me with the week I've had, for I mean, and we've talked a lot about, um, you know, learning to live more like a Portuguese uh, and the training required to take part in the, in the intense Festa season. I thought you might like to launch a boot camp. Uh, where, <laughs> where I've can... seen that. I've seen yeah. that yesterday. And I thought, mm, I mean, according to that, maybe I'm not very Portuguese. <laughs> okay, all right. So the part of the boot camp could be creating this impression that that's what we do all the time. Because it certainly looks like that to me. Go to bed at 2 a.m. and be at work by 9 every morning. Uh, uh, eat a three-course lunch. This is what you can learn how to do on the, on the boot camp. Eat a three-course lunch daily with chips and rice. And drink rice. wine with, meal, with every meal every day and have coffee before bedtime and still go to sleep. What did I miss? <laughs> yes, well, as I said, when I saw that yesterday, I thought, mm, I'm definitely not Portuguese. 